One of the things that comes up in my office all the time is the discomfort associated with the disconnect between our feelings and our thoughts, our intellect versus the emotions. And it's not always obvious how to deal with this because it's not always clear which one of those is right. And here's why. An easy way of conceptualizing this is our intellect is sort of our slow linear processing system. It sits there and looks at the data kind of one by one and helps us figure out what to do. It's logical. Our emotions, on the other hand, well, they look at everything. They look at our whole past experience, everything that's happening around us, and give us sort of this really quick feedback about how to act. And when those two are lined up with each other, there's no problem. We just go ahead and do stuff, right? The emotions and the intellect all say we're good to go. But when they're out of alignment, which one has the right data? Is it the emotion that's accurately picking up on something from what's going on in our past that is worth paying attention to? Or do we, for example, have past traumas that are influencing the emotions in a way that's not meaningful anymore? And the intellect is rightly saying, well, that doesn't count now. How do you know? Well, it's going to take some time to figure it out, but the first step is recognizing that that's what's happening so that you can piece it together. And that's a lot of what happens in the therapy room. So thought I'd share for some that's helpful and please post in the comments and let me know what you think.